Hello and welcome, Diamond Fernandez here and I'm excited to be talking to you about sugar and heart disease. Now can sugar cause heart disease? Soda has been in the media quite a bit in the last few months, even to go as far as to ban sales of larger soft drinks and convenience stores in New York area. Of course that did not go through. The fact is there's going to be people who neglect their health and more so if their economic status is lower. It is more expensive to invest in your health than not to, and there are reasons why there's a link to sugar and heart disease, where fast food chains and simple carbohydrates are cheaper to consume versus healthy fruits and vegetables. And when it comes to drinking soda soft drinks, it's cheaper to consume sugar soda soft drinks versus a bottled water. What is the link between sugar and heart disease? Sugar is addictive, and is an addictive element that can lead to diabetes, which then can lead to heart disease. Now, new research out of Europe showed that just 12 ounce increment in sugar sweetened or artificially sweetened soft drinks consumption was associated with the development of type 2 diabetes. The soda and heart disease link should be more like sugar and heart disease link. Sugar is responsible for the beginning of the inflammatory process which causes our cholesterol in our body to be used up in a negative way. So even going deeper into this sugar and heart disease link, it should be really noted that poor carbohydrates and heart disease are very linked. Carbohydrates, when processed in our body, turn into sugar. And once again, simple carbohydrates are cheaper and easier to come by versus healthy nutrition. So it does become an awareness understanding to the average person that sugar is not good. And soda is nothing but sugar, which causes a surge of hormones that could eventually lead to heart disease. As I always say, it starts with the right mindset to attack the problem of sugar and heart disease. Many people know that things are not good for us, but we do them anyways. We also have to look at the addictive properties of sugar. Just like smoking is addictive, so is sugar. And just like so many people eventually give up smoking, so can the addictive properties of sugar can be given up too. If you want to change, things will change. And we know that there is an important link to sugar and heart disease. We have known this for years and I believe the direction taking focusing on just cholesterol is wrong. You can always read our post on sugar and cholesterol and understand the real cause of heart disease. I hope you enjoyed this and please go to our website and be sure to watch our free webinar on the 7 most common heart health mistakes you can make. To your heart health success, this is Diamond Fernandez.